I'm Chap Briard, CEO of Monroe Office Equipment. Thank you for giving us a moment of your time to present to you one of our many office products designed to control your current cost and at the same time make your office more productive and efficient. This demonstration will be informative without the use of technical terms that honestly we don't expect you to know. We will present to you the features and benefits of the machine that you can relate to in your day-to-day -day world, including the printing, scanning, and copying aspects. Please feel free to call me personally at 388-4600 should you have any additional questions. Hi, my name is Darren Denny, Sales Support Manager for Munro Office Equipment. I've been working for Munro Office Equipment for 10 years now. What I'd like to introduce to you today is the Rico WX4130N Short Throw Projector. Uh, it has been launched now since February. This is our first time uh, that we've had it. We've had it for now two weeks and been able to play with it. And there's some significant difference between a short throw projector and a standard projector. If you've ever been in a meeting and somebody set up a projector, they get up in front of it and there's always shadows in front of your projection. Uh, this device only has to be between 6 and 12 inches away from a wall, allowing for the projection to be between a 48 inch projection all the way to an 80 inch projection and you don't have any fear of a bunch of shadows in the way of the projection. So what you can see is, is if you're working on something in the office, you could simply stand here and, and you could be in front of it, however there are no shadows. You can walk back and forth and use your body like you'd want to, but there are no shadows in front of the, of the document that you're talking about. Uh, the device is designed to do between 10 and 20 people in any given setting. Uh, the nice thing about it is it can be dropped on your network and allows for multiple people to access the device and be able to share presentations without having to unhook a laptop, rehook a laptop, go back again, oh wait, let's boot up this and let's boot up that, and all of the downtime that you have with most meetings that you go to. Uh, the device also has a, a USB port allowing for external mouse or external drives. It has also in it an HDMI port allowing for a high def video to be projected. The device is 3D capable, so you can put a 3D movie in, a, in your player, hook it into the HDMI port with the 3D glasses and show a 3D movie. Um, you can see we're showing this on a simple wall here in our office. If the wall was white and a little bit flatter because we have a rough surface, it would be even a better projection than what we have now. Uh, it can also be uh, projected on glass, uh, so that can give you some idea that you could use it for a, um, a running video uh, commercial at your office if you need it to be. And again, no shadowing when you're standing here doing your presentations. One of the other options I'd like to show you about the projector from Rico is the fact that we have something called e-beam technology. The e-beam module simply hangs on the wall with a magnetic strip. You place it where you want to on the wall. It's designed to have double-sided tape. It just hangs there. And you have multiple of these strips that you can put throughout your offices or multiple locations. And because the product is completely portable, and what you do is simply walk up, hang the e-beam device, hook it into your computer, and what it's going to ask you to do is you need to toggle it in, in, in a way that your pin now is your mouse. It allows you to draw, drag and drop the module wherever you want. And so now I can take my meeting and turn it into a very interactive meeting. Most people in their meetings They'll walk around, they'll have the gigantic poster boards with the post-it note stuff on the back, make a bunch of notes, hang it up on the wall, hang it up on the wall, hang it up on the wall for all the stuff they've talked about. But the problem ends up being, where do you put all that paper when you're done? Who's going to write all that information down? Who's going to have access to that? This allows you to take your meeting and make it digital. So if I'm working on my golf tournament, and I want to say, okay, let's talk about what kind of teams we want to have. Let's talk about what kind of contests we want to have. You can take your new technology, turn it into a pin and say, you know what, thin, I want it to be a blue marker or green or purple or whatever. In this case, I want it kind of blue and hit, all right, let's talk about this for a minute. Do we want a hole in one contest? Yeah, we want a hole in one contest. We want a longest drive contest. We want a longest putt contest. So uh, do we want a theme? Yeah, let's talk about a theme. We want it to be uh, Cuba Day or whatever you want to call it. So. You can make all those changes and you're not actually writing on your wall. This is a digital thing. And what you can do at that point is you can actually save the document. It's going to ask me what I want to do with it. If I want to save it in this or that. And now it allows me that I've saved this document with these changes. I can email that to everyone that was in the room. So the information now, everybody has it. Nobody had to worry about taking all those notes off of the, the stuff hanging on the wall. 
Everybody's got the same stuff we talked about. You can freehand write or whatever you want to do. That is what eBeam allows you to do. Again, completely portable. Another thing with the eBeam technology that we found very fascinating is I love sports. A lot of people love sports. I tape my son when he plays football and I take it home and I want to show him how good he did or how his team did and I could use this technology to highlight certain things on the film. So if I'm watching a particular play and I can double tap and say I want to open this play, make it wide and I say okay here we go, let's, let's stop it here, let's look at the alignment and if I want to make changes and if I need to mark this up for him and I want to highlight a specific area, I could say you know, you know this guy right here is out of place. He's, a, he's in front of the line of scrimmage. Or if I want to say uh, here, you know, the tailback is too far deep in the backfield. Okay? Or if I want to let the play run at that point and say, no, I don't want to save the changes, hit go, let it snap, and then freeze frame and say, okay, let's talk about what was going on here. Well, again, you want to highlight something, you could write on the screen for them. Or you could circle something or highlight it in a big highlighter, big yellow highlighter, and say, here guys, look, you know, everybody on the line of scrimmage was standing up. We taught you how to fire out low to make your blocks. That can be a very helpful tool. Now, I'm using it for a sports analogy, but this can be used for anything. If you're going to talk about anything going on within your office uh, that you want to use, you may have filmed a commercial or something that you want to highlight, something didn't look right, or whatever kind of thing you want to do. Again, completely portable technology and a wonderful addition. Another great feature that I find very valuable is the fact that you can do a presentation with the projector and iPads, multiple iPads, through the Rico Tamago app. Uh, it's downloadable free in the iTunes store. Uh, basically, you can use any PDF document and present this, and it actually will project the image from the iPad into the device up on the screen. And all it is is simply it's a Wi-Fi device that this is using. It not only changes the screenshot up here, but also up to 20 iPads within the room will also be tied in to this device. Again, you can have multiple presenters available, so if they have, if there are two or three people in the room that need to make a presentation, each one of them, will, you can lock, have them a lock code that they can put in and allows them to be a presenter at any given time that they need to show a document. Again, it flips through, it flips that page, it also will show it up on the screen for somebody who may not have an iPad. Another great feature about this is that you can actually uh, pull up other documents. You can also write on the screen again. Uh, if you just pick what you want as far as size and a color, you can make whatever scribble scrabble you want. It'll show up on somebody's screen. It also shows up on the projector. Again, you can save the document. It's a very interactive way of doing your conference presentation and uh, I would look forward to showing you more of these wonderful features, give us a call here at Monroe Office Equipment, 318-388-4600. Thank you.